The first time you come to Sundance is really exciting because you have no idea what to expect. The minute we landed, we got off the plane and we were just like swarmed by photographers. They were like rabbits. They just like multiplied out of thin air. I came here once before, probably about 12 years ago in my early days at CNN. It's an interesting experience. I don't quite get what everyone's doing. There's a lot of hipsters walking around. I don't even know if they're going to films. They just seem to be walking around and having coffee and being hip. My first time at Sundance, I remember just having so much fun. Just being young and running around and it feeling a lot more like carefree than it feels now. Every time I come to Sundance, all hell break loose. I always have some kind of mishap. I break my foot, I have a migraine, I have a panic attack, I have an asthma attack, and I don't sleep. I think it's the altitude, it doesn't do well to my brain. This is my first time at Sundance. I wish I hadn't been suddenly warned about altitude sickness because I made myself feel very unwell just in LA hearing about it. The first film I went with was Baghead, and I came here and I think I was sleeping on someone's floor. My first Sundance, I had this terrible experience when I first showed the film in a public screening and I was in the back of the house and the film started to go and I suddenly realized, oh my god, I have to show this to complete strangers. It hadn't really sunk in. This is my first time in Sundance and it's amazing. It feels very communal and quite accessible on a kind of personal level. That's what's really exciting to be a part of.